Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you how con how to construct um, this mini album. Uh, this was requested by R Monograss One here on YouTube, and D Maslin One also requested um, to show how I make mini albums using six by nine envelopes. So I have. To, to do this project, you need seven um, six by nine envelopes, and these are the clasp envelopes. Um, you can buy ones without the clasps, um, but they don't offer those in my area. So, and so the first thing you need to do is remove the clasp, and um, you just need something to put in there. You can lift up the edges. I am actually using a razor blade because it works, and it's right here. I do not necessarily re recommend it because I don't want anybody to cut themselves on accident. So you just need to lift up those little prongs in there so you can slide it out a little easier. And there we go. So that part is done. And the second part that you need to do is um, adhere this flap down. So put a line of adhesive around this edge here and then around this edge here and fold it down. And then you'll have a sealed envelope. And what I did next is on four of the envelopes, I scored in from the top here six inches. So then you have six inches here and then three inches here. And then I used my paper trimmer to cut these edges. So I have now have two pockets. So you need to do that to four of them. And on two of them, you need to cut the top ends off, um, creating a six by six inch pocket. So that's two of your pages. And then for the seventh one, and what you need to do is glue this flap down, which I recommend with these envelopes using a dry adhesive rather than um, a wet adhesive because it will make the envelopes warp, which on some projects, I mean, you know, that looks nice, you know, if you're going for that look. Um, but I figured I would warn you. And I'm going to burnish this. And I'm just going to trim off. Oh, probably about two millimeters. Off of both ends. to do for this piece is just fold it directly in half. And you could go through and measure it and score it, but for this for this piece I'm not going to. I'm just going to fold it. So now it looks like that. 
<laughs> so the way this would be assembled is this being your first page, um, this being your second page, um, you'd hear this flap to this one, and then um, you'd hear this flap to the six inch piece, and then this piece like that. And that's what it looks like in this album here. And for the front cover, or for the first page on this one, instead of cutting a slit, what I did was, um, I, before I adhered the flap down, I put a piece, piece of chipboard in there to make it sturdy, adhered the flap down, and then covered it with pat pattern paper. I didn't make it, the first page, a pocket in this album. So now I am going to go through and assemble all this. And on this album I'm going to do a accordion fold. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to measure up um, Five eighths, or er, yeah, five eighths of an inch up, and make a line. So I'm not going to put adhesive in this section here. And I'm just gonna put adhesive all on the back of this making sure I get all the way butted up to the edges put plenty in the center so now I'm going to take another flat piece like this and lay it over top this one lining up the spine and all the edges and laying it down so now my first page is adhered to my So now I have adhered, or added all my adhesive, I made a 3 8 or 5 8 of an inch mark on this side, to, so I want to add adhesive here, and the same thing on this side, and I put adhesive around, lined it up to this line and all the way around all these edges on both sides. And now just do the same. Thing as the other pages, just put up your spine and line up your edges and lay it down.
And I'm going to stick my bone hole back in and burnish it down. And line it up with the other half. Now we have our album assembled. Um, got a pocket here, one here, and all these end pieces, and another one here, one here, and then these two bigger pockets, and all the openings. And so that is the same basic concept that I put together this one. The only difference is I made this one an accordion. So um, with this, the spine of this one, I just um, added adhesive all the way to the edge rather than um, made it accordion. But I do um, like the accordion style a lot better. And you can do that so many different ways. So, on this album, I wanted to make it a little bit different than that one, and I want to have chipboard covers. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to use two more of these envelopes and do the same thing like what I did in the middle to attach the two pieces together and do that. Now, what I'm going to do is go through and add my papers. Um, at this point, you could ink your ed edges. Um, I don't think I'm going to on this. I'm just going to leave it the regular color on that album. I did ink all the edges in black. And uh, it is easier before you assemble your album to ink all the edges because then you don't have all these little creases here where you might see um, the color of the envelopes. So you might want to do that before and after is fine. 